January 22nd, 2020. There's this push about January 24th and into the 25th of this rapture from Steve Fletcher. There's also talk about YouTube. Uh, I've done some videos uh, on it, but I can't, I can't get them up for a few days. We have a little bit of a, a problem going on with some, uh, some YouTube stuff. So we'll get it, we'll get it all sorted out in the next couple of days. Anyway, hello. Uh, I've done some videos uh, on it, but I can't, I can't get them up for a few days. We have a little bit of. Uh, a problem going on with some uh, some YouTube stuff, so we'll get it we'll get it all sorted out in the next couple days. Anyway, I love you guys. Peace and grace. By the establishment, it's here, it's here, it's here now. It's just a very short matter of time. Once this, once, once the levy breaks. Once the bell rings, once this goes down, bam. Once this goes down, and it's here. It's here. It's here now. It's just a very short matter of time. Once this, once, once the levy breaks, once the bell rings, once this goes down, bam. Once this goes down, and, and I'm going to be very, very careful right with what I said. Once it's the bell rings, the, I don't know at what moment it all happens. I don't. Be better that way. I just know I got to go ring a bell, and I just know everything that the Lord's told me I have to do see has always right here. manifested supernaturally. No one can argue with that. You see that? Area? I mean, look at the information I'm showing you guys. I mean, look at the Bible right here. Right here. Let us, so, yeah. if anyone says you're created in the image of God, and that's the Father, Son, and the right. Holy Ghost. That's liars. JFK. They're a liar. I don't care if he's so wearing a robe and calls himself a preacher. He's a liar. He's get converted and you get your sentence commuted. And then when your host body dies, you get to go back. Or you don't get converted and as soon as your host body dies, you go straight to the levy. And your food. Now you know what all this scorpion stuff is I've been showing you guys. Broad you know street. what I mean? Let's Maybe we should look at a little bit of it. 17 like, JFK. Uh, like, building eight. <laughs> look at this. No, look at this perfume. Man, choose. Man, choose it. I guess. Yes, it's a bug. Uh, if you look up, uh, choose, it means to grind. Building eight. Oh, let's see. What is it? There it is. Ah, uh, no, that's. Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know how you say it. Here's Comcast. Let's see if Here's there's fire a fire engine number eight. If there is a uh, audio five, and so you know now as we go eight. through, you know here you go. Here's Air here's building eight, Penn Center eight, John F. Kennedy Boulevard, Suite eight hundred, Route three. Here's your Comcast building right across the street from it. And over here you got your Masonic Hall. Lodge. With the top post being in this video. From that scene, but we have seen uh, several dozen police officers heading in that direction. We see the SWAT. Right there. Teams are also heading in that direction. It's right there at the beginning of JFK Boulevard and Broad Street. Along with the Comcast building being there, along with number eight being there, along with being a Broadway Street and JFK. Here's Penn Center eight, right across the street. The Comcast building. Down the street more, you got your, you got your Masonic Temple landmark that they're showing you everything here. Comcast, 
the landmark being the mirror number eight these eight firefighters that's Tony Yates Building eight. Roger, and down the street to where the initial shooting uh, may have taken place. That's Since why he's here, standing though. over here on this side of the street. He's the he's the landmark too, showing you the Comcast con caddy corner, and then mirror imaged over on that end. We have not heard any shots fired. We were warned though when we came on the scene to be careful because there was a person going from roof There's to roof. There's Tony Yates. As police were getting those reports, of course they were trying to get to those areas that people were reporting that they heard uh, shots fired. So they were telling people as they were walking. It's just everywhere it be in between showing you the the actual target itself. Love Park. Love Park. This is the angle Love Park is facing. The William Penn Tower. Right on this side. Love Park is right behind it. Caddy Corner. William Penn looking like a cross. The heart. Caddy Corner. It's here now. It's just a very short matter of time. Once this, once, once the levee breaks, once the bell rings, once this goes down, bam. Once this goes down, and I'm going to be very careful with what I said. Like once the bell rings, I don't know at what moment it all happens. I don't. I just know I got to go ring a bell, and I just know everything that the Lord's told me I have to do has always manifested supernaturally. No one can argue with that. I mean, that's all your home host body is. It's just a prison suit in which you either get converted and you get your sentence commuted, and then when your host body dies, you get to go back, or yeah, you don't rounded. get converted, and as soon as your host body dies, so you go straight to rounded bed. edge. And your food. And then, now the pit's gonna hatch. Do you understand? Yeah, I don't know what to say except wow. 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 This is time for a group hug. I love you guys. Be at peace. Don't be afraid. There's nothing to be afraid of because when you're on the rock, you can withstand the storm. You can withstand what's coming. You can stand there with confidence in the face of it. Group hug. Major hug. I love all you guys, and thank you. For, I just want to thank everybody. Listen, everybody, every ma every mail item, every letter, every every single thing. I'm so just I'm grateful for y'all. Thank you for sending them, and thank you for your help and your contributions. And you know. Super Bowl Fifty Four. <laughs> all right, let's see what dirt we can dig up on this guy. But there were no skeletons in Daniel's closet. Daniel's enemies had examined his life and found nothing to attack, so they made something up. This should be expected treatment for Christians. We do not expect justice or fair play from this world, yet we trust in a God who can defend us. It's like some out of an Old Testament story. In a quarter of a mile, to the highway that's going to take me there is called Carefree Highway. Carefree Highway. To take me east. 849. To take exit 223 towards Carefree Highway East. 223. <laughs> Carefree. 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 Caref
where you see uh, that tower that looks like it belongs to a church because a lot of the uh, squad cars are going down there. They blocked up part of that street in the last five minutes or so. And again, uh, they have a lot of uh, forces headed down that way. Also, one block from us and up the street. Uh, maybe another location. That's We're not sure challenge. how many locations there are right now. They seem to say that this person might be going from one place to another. Uh, there are undercover cars all over the place at this point right now. Many locations there are right now. They seem to say that this person might be going from one place to another. Uh, they're uh, from uh, JFK Park here in Jersey City. We'll continue, of course, to monitor the situation that we seem to be in the middle of. So we seem to be kind of in the center of where everything is happening and the area of concern for law uh, coming down the street. If you take a look down JFK Boulevard, uh, more are coming. So we seem to be kind of in the Going to the highway that's going to take me there is called Carefree Highway. Carefree Highway. What about that 848? A minute off. To take me. Right to take exit 223 toward. 223. Activity. Now, just getting in this from, from our assignment desk. They're being told the suspects are inside the J.C. Kosher supermarket. This is on 223 Martin Luther King Drive. It's not a bodega. It's actually a Jewish supermarket. So I To me, it's after their 21 days. So 21 subtract 223 two, is 2 2 2020 Super Bowl. Okay. All right. So, anyway, so yeah, so, so see, in the arm. So, anyway, so yeah, so. So, 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 so. anyway, work I did before I got saved. The whole system has become totally made. Totally. Now, the whole, the whole system has become totally obvious that's why he clicked on that and it lasted for not even a split second totally manifest and now this little thing he's got me doing of the silhouette of christ and all the birds leaving and the the sun that's on the floor that's a set of twins came yeah, because there's a lot of Click has a message for you anymore. guys they're both this both eyes are single down so, you know, you're being oh, in a lot of occasions. So, you know, you're being stalked in a lot of occasions. So, you know, whatever it is, whoever it is, just leave it with the Lord God. Just trust the Lord with everything. Don't try and worry about it. You know, a child or your mother or your dad or this kid that's you gone astray. You hear what he's saying? In other words, just who gives a F about anybody? Just come with me. That's what's out there. The width of the building is 76, Adam. Like in 1976. There's a set of twins. <laughs> There's a bell that says 17, sorrow, 76. 17, the sorrow. You're going to see it 17 JFK in Philadelphia. Are y'all getting this? Clearly. Do you know the level of impossible that all this is? All you false prophet hunters, you know, I feel so sorry for y'all because... Uh, on your best day, you got maybe a, another day or to be in this dimension before you go into the eternal abyss. Because y'all are done. Completely done. Yep. If you call someone a false prophet and they be in this dimension before you go into the eternal abyss. 15, sorrow, 76, Adam. Are y'all getting this? Do you know the level of impossible that all this is? All you false prophet hunters, you know, I feel so sorry for y'all because uh, on your best day, you got maybe uh, another dare to be in this dimension. 
question before you go into the eternal abyss. Because y'all are done. Bye bye. Completely done. YouTube strikes. Yep. If you call someone a false prophet and they are not a false prophet, they are actually they are manifesting spiritual, supernatural, spiritual. Uh, yeah, 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 right, 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 right. Like myself is what you're really trying to. It's like Robin. Spirit of the living God gifts. You're blaspheming the Holy Spirit. Uh, I've done some videos uh, on it, but I can't. I can't get them up for a few days. We have a little bit of a. A problem going on. A little bit of a problem along with some uh, some, some YouTube stuff. So we'll get it. We'll get it all sorted out in the next couple of days. Next couple of days. Twenty third, twenty fourth. Sounds like there's a delivery coming. In the third year of King Cyrus of Persia, a thing was revealed into Daniel. And the thing was true, but the time appointed was long. He understood the thing and had understanding of the vision. In those days, Daniel was mourning for three full weeks. Ate no pleasant bread, neither came flesh nor wine in his mouth, neither did he anoint himself at all, till three whole weeks were fulfilled. And in the four and twentieth day of the first month, which everybody the, the the rapture king Steve Fletcher and the rest are following suit as the first day in the 24th first month 24th day of the month as a literal term is by the side of the great river which is Hittico he looked up and he's seen a certain man clothed in linen whose loins were girded with fine gold, his body like the burrow, and his face the appearance of the lightning, and his eyes as lamps of fire, and his arms as the feet, and like colored black, polished brass. And the voice of his words were like the multitude of a whole bunch of people. And Daniel alone saw the vision, for the men that were with him saw not the vision, but a great quaking fell upon them, so that they fled to hide themselves. Therefore I was alone and saw this great vision, and there remained no strength in me. When they cut the sheep's tongue, you can't talk. For my communist was turned in me into corruption, and I retained no strength. But I heard the voice, the voice of his words, and when I heard the voice of his words and I was in a deep sleep my face my face toward the ground and behold a hand touched me which set me upon my knees and upon my palms my hand and he said to me Daniel a man greatly beloved understand the words I speak unto you and stand upright for unto you am I now sent and when he had spoken this word unto me I stood trembling Nothing's going to happen on the 24th, except for a possible shutdown of some sort. And he said unto me, Daniel, man, great and beloved, uh, I already read that. Fear not, Daniel, from the first day that you set your heart to understand and to chastise yourself before your God. Your words were heard, and I am come forth for your words. But... There's a prince of the kingdom of Persia that is going to withstand Daniel for 21 days. But lo, Michael, one of the chief princes, came to help me while I remained there with the kings of Persia. Now, I am come to make you understand what shall befall your people in the latter days, for the vision is for many days. And when he had spoke such words to me, I set my face towards the ground and I became speechless and behold one like the similitude of the sons of men touched my lips and then I opened my mouth and I spoke and I said to him that stood before me O oh my Lord by the vision my sorrows are turned upon me and I have retained no strength for how can a servant of this my Lord talk with this my Lord as for me straightway there remains no strength in me neither is there breath left in me so obviously it's not literal breath or else he would be dead. 
was. We bred with them. But that's where free will comes in. And free will, angels have free will. And you can choose licentious, Eleuthera, freedom, or you can choose legitimate freedom in Christ. As he shakes his head. If you choose licentious <laughs> freedom, it leads to death. I know, because I've been there. And I, that's what I chose. Obviously, but... In free will, angels have free will. And you can choose licentious, Eleuthera, freedom, or you can choose legitimate freedom in Christ. If you choose licentious freedom, it leads to death. I know, because I've been there. Okay, Jesus. You know, that's what I chose. Obviously, but God himself. As a matter of fact, he did it. He just did it through me. He just did it as I pointed to myself. I'm just a vessel. Pretty crazy, huh? Yeah, and he tells them where it is, and they're all on this race to get to it. Let's see if I can find it in this. Uh, yeah, we just you just passed it. It, it was nine one one. There's this movie, and everyone's trying to find this treasure. This guy goes off the highway, and before he dies, he tells everybody about this the greatest treasure in the world, and it's and he tells them where it is, and they're all on this race to get to it. He tells them where it is. They're all in this race to get to it. If it doesn't happen, it was canceled. Let's see if I can find it in this one. called unto him the twelve, and began to send them forth by two and two, and gave them power over unclean spirits, and commanded them that they should take nothing for their journey, save a staff only. No scrip, no bread, no money in their purse. And gave them power over unclean spirits. And commanded them that they should take nothing for their journey. Save the staff only. No scrip, no bread, no money. Daniel 8, 27. And I, Daniel, fainted, and was sick certain days. Afterward I rose up, and did the king's business, and I was astonished at the vision, but none understood it. Daniel's reaction to the vision? Physical shock and astonishment. He may well have been puzzled about why Yahweh would permit even this brief time of brutal oppression under the little horn. Implicitus, that's the sin. That's, that's it. Sin, city, and the letter S means slaughter. There's a certain disciple at Damascus named Ananias. And to him said the Lord in a vision, Ananias. And he said, Behold, I am here, Lord. And the Lord said unto him, Arise, and go into the street which is called Straight, and inquire in the house of Judas for one called Saul of Tarsus. For behold, he prayeth, and hath seen in a vision a man named Ananias coming in, and putting his hand on him, that he might receive his sight. Then Ananias answered, Lord, I have heard by many of this man how much evil he hath done to thy saints at Jerusalem. And here he hath authority from the chief priests to bind all that call on thy name. But the Lord said unto him, Go thy way, for he is a chosen vessel unto me to bear my name before the Gentiles and kings and the children of Israel. For I will show him how great things he must suffer for my name's sake. And Ananias went his way you know what and an entered into the house, means? and putting his hands on him said, Brother Saul, the Lord, even Jesus, that appeared unto thee in the way as thou camest, hath sent me, that thou mightest receive thy sight and be filled with the Holy Ghost. And immediately there fell from his eyes as it had when been scaled. When thou passest through the waters, I will... And he received sight forthwith, and arose and was baptized. 
And when he had received meat, he was strengthened. Save that the Holy Ghost witnesseth in every city, saying that bonds and afflictions abide me. But none of these things move me, neither count I my life dear unto myself, so that I might finish my course with joy and the ministry which I have received of the Lord Jesus to testify the gospel of the grace of God. And now, behold, I know that ye all among whom I have gone preaching the kingdom of God shall see my face no more. Scourge, a knotted whip, scourge, Akrab, remember Barack Obama, oh, a scorpion. A scourge, a knotted whip, scourge. Ah, oh. So, you know, you're being stalked in a lot of occasions. Down to, uh, like, right side up, upside down triangle. I mean, you couldn't even think this up, guys. You couldn't even think this up. Anyway, I love you guys. Yeah, I just wanted to share with you what's going on here and what I've been doing. I'm trying to get the building completely finished. All the lighting's done. Uh, I've done some videos uh, on it, but I can't. I can't get them uh, for a few days. We have a little bit of uh, a problem going on with some. Uh, some YouTube stuff, so we'll get it. We'll get it all sorted out in the next couple days. Anyway, I love you guys. Peace and grace. If you've been coming to this channel for a while, it should be just completely and just painfully obvious that the it should be just completely and just painfully obvious. At the end is coming. And now he's going to tell you how he's going to turn the sky, the sky dark. Because I'm not going to postulate. I'm not going to say, well, I think. But I think I need that's important. I think I need to make sure that you understand. There are some possibilities that everyone should absolutely be aware of that you might see. We might look up and see the sky turn black. We may see. Because the Bible says, when I come... Now, what he's getting ready to say is what I've been talking about for a long time. Which is, when you see these things in the sky, to step outside... And watch them. Enjoy the show. Um, how many will I find that have true faith? Well, I'll tell you what. You know, if there's a, the sky turns black, right? And there's a bunch of xenomorphs coming from the sky. Who the hell is going to be able to stand there? I mean, seriously. It's going to be like... <clears throat> you're going to be freaking running. Everyone's going to be running. Unless you are... I already knew it was coming, and unless you know that you're protected from it. Who the hell is going to be able to stand there? I mean, seriously, guys. It's going to be like, <clears throat> you're going to be freaking running. Everyone's going to be running. Unless you are was coming and unless you know that you're protected from it. Now, it's still going to take faith to stand there when it happens. I agree. Let's 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 take a couple possibilities. Let's say we are here. Let's say that's the moment that we get called away. So let's say the earth cracks open, smoke comes out of the pit. And out of 
Out of the Smoke Locust come upon the earth and this is it. This is the moment everyone's been waiting for. The four, three, two, one before the fire. And here come the locusts. Let's see these locusts. And here comes all my holographic 70 technology images. Locusts aren't allowed to sting men that have the seal of God in their foreheads. Well, that... That's because we're not deceived by it. Tells you that there's got to be men standing around that do have the seal of God in their foreheads. Yeah, there'd be 144k. Couple videos uh, to upload uh, last night, and I made one for Robin. Robin. David slays Goliath once again with his. Notice the word right, W R I T E, right hand, right hand. That would mean. Goliath is being slayed. The spirit of Goliath is being slayed in the future with words. Okay, words. Opening the people's minds to let them see perfect written word. Perfect written word. So you can look these numbers up too here. Five. But the prince of kingdom, the kingdom of Persia, which stood me one in 21 days, but lo, Michael, one of the chief princes, came to help me, and I remained there with the kings of Persia. But I will show you that which is noted in the scripture of truth, and there is none that holdeth with me in these things, but Michael your prince. The tidings out of the east and out of the north shall trouble him. Therefore he shall go forth with great fury to destroy and utterly to make away with many. And he shall plant his tabernacles of his palace between the seas and a glorious holy mountain. Yet he shall come to his end, and none shall help him. And at that time shall Michael stand up, the great prince, which stands for the children of your people. And there shall be a time of trouble for them, such as never was since there was a nation even to that same time, and at that time your people shall be delivered, every one that shall be written in the book. Send Jesus Christ, which before was preached unto you, whom the heaven must receive until the times of restitution of all things, which God hath spoken by the mouth of all his holy prophets since the world began. For Moses truly said unto the fathers, a prophet shall the Lord your God raise up unto you of your brethren, like unto me. Him shall ye hear in all things whatsoever he shall say unto you. And it shall come to pass that every soul which will not hear the prophet.